Hi everyone, this is Wally Nichols with the Asset Guidance Group Weekly Update for the week ending March the 4th, 2022. The Ukraine war obviously dominates the news. Uh, the great, it, it even overshadowed the fantastic jobs report that came in uh, early this morning uh, here before the trading day started that actually showed much uh, increased employment uh, across the nation and also the fact that wages were holding flat which serves to calm inflation fears so that was some good news today and so what it is uh, really all the markets all the major indexes what you're seeing here is we're still in a in a firm trend okay they, they, uh, that that is losing downside momentum they keep trying to run these rallies and trying to bring it up we just keep hitting heavy resistance there's more bad news comes in and then so again today and probably over the weekend we'll probably go back down on all and all of the uh, major indexes probably uh, testing uh, support doesn't mean that there's not bullish areas out there as a matter of fact just a sec here I'll show you just ran I didn't even cherry pick these models this is just uh, random stuff that uh, we were we were picking out and built in, in the process of building models for their clients and that I took note of that I want to share with you today so that's some good news for you uh, as we talk about uh, planning and what you need to focus on here over the next three, four to, to ten years or seven years, ten years out in the future, that's 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 what we that's that's our wheelhouse. Okay, that's what we have to do for you. So just before we get into the weeds on that, let me show you. Let me show you that there's always a, a way to to do well uh, in the markets, even during uh, very difficult times. All right, let's get into that. Okay, here I want to show you uh, on your screen, this was uh, a, a comparison that we did with, uh, uh, we had occasion just a few weeks ago to deal with a Vanguard target date fund for set for 2035. Well, I'm not trying to pick on any particular company, okay, but uh, this was just one of them because we were talking about target date funds in one of our classes. And so I was like, okay, well, let's see, you know, how these things are great. And this is one of the best ones. This is one of the better ones that are out there. A very impressive um, uh, how that it's been. So what we're showing you here is just a comparison. Now the target date fund here I will show you. Okay, I'm using I'm using our uh, our comparing that with our all caps model. We call it ranks because we uh, we go back in and uh, the part of the database is uh, ones that uh, view uh, goes in and, and and looks at companies that top analysts across the nation have ranked as a, as a strong buy, and so that's the reason we call it that. But it's it. It, so it, it's an all caps model because it cuts across all different uh, uh, asset allocation styles, etc. Okay, this is the uh, this is the Vanguard, and then this is our, uh, our uh, layout of the, of the all caps. The ranks model is how that goes, and then and then if we want to look at styles, this is how uh, that uh, those two compare, standing that way. See, so you can see that we're we're cutting across. Uh, fairly, uh, fairly evenly with them. Uh, a lot more uh, mid cap, okay, and blend than uh, than what the the uh, uh, Vanguard target date 2035 would use. So let's go back then and look at performance and value uh, on this. So the screen on the left side is a pure percentage basis. The blue line is uh, the Asset Guidance Group uh, all caps model uh, portfolio that we make available to clients when it fits their risk tolerance. And so the yellow line then is the uh, Vanguard target date fund for 2035. So this is a one year look on that. The chart on the right hand side is starting out evenly if both funds came in at $100,000. Okay. And so the number on the right then, you can see how the, how the numbers uh, grow, how the lines diverge. And the number on the right then is the amount of money that over the past year from March the 4th, if you had put in $100,000 on March the 4th, 2021, in either of the in, in each of these two funds, okay, then by March the third of 2022, uh, the Asset Guidance Group uh, ranks model would have returned you $125,429 versus the target date fund out of $102,903. We try to help people when they let us, okay, we really do help people. We try to get people to let us help them. If you let us help you, we will help you. Um, uh, get where where you where you need to be. You just need to let us do it. Okay. Now, past uh, you know past results are no indication of future returns. Okay, but uh, 
Anyway, let's let's do a, a one, three, and five year cut at this. Okay, so this would be the numbers on the three year basis. So this would be going back if you got in each of these funds back March the fourth, twenty nineteen. Okay, and those are the percentage basis returns. The blue line again is the asset guidance group, uh, all caps or ranks model, uh, and and uh, that's the one hundred eight versus the yellow line on the bottom or uh, somewhat greenish hue to it uh, is the target date fund uh, Vanguard target date twenty thirty five, and then on the right is the same uh, dollar value amount that you would have had had you invested on March the fourth, twenty nineteen. Uh, versus March the 3rd, 2022. And then last but not least, let's take a look at the five-year cut. Uh, the reason I'm showing you this is because that's what is required. And so uh, these are the, the same numbers. Uh, again, the blue line is uh, Asset Guidance Group ranks model. The uh, line below the yellow uh, green, uh, light greenish line is the uh, Vanguard target date fund. Okay, so why do I show you this is because uh, uh, this is just one particular fund that we that, that I pulled out. This is not cherry picked. I could show you any other other number of funds, dividend style and other style. This is the way it's, it, it it all comes down to uh, fundamental analysis and then money management as we go, and that's what we do here in terms of asset management. Now, what does that mean to you over time? All right. Well, let's shift the gears and have that discussion. Let's get into that. All right. Okay, so over time, all right, uh, things change. This came to my mind uh, because I recently received a letter from uh, an, an, a physician uh, in, in the greater Atlanta area, and he reached out and let everybody know that he was reluctantly uh, leaving the practice after 50 years, okay, at age 80, all right, at age 80. So his enjoyment, uh, when most people start thinking about retirement, his enjoyment was continuing to do what he did, and he goes through the letter. It's uh, it, it's it, it, it's it's quite the letter. It goes it goes on for a, a full page, all right. Um, and and he's talking about how he so thoroughly enjoyed what he did that he just uh, you know continued to do that because it it, it made him happy and everything. And, and the sentence that, that really caught my eye was, since I have turned 80, I feel it is now time to enjoy my family and travel more without any time restraints, okay, while I'm still healthy enough to do so. And that, I thought, was just a beautiful commentary because you look at people that work in the markets. You look at Charlie Munger. Uh, Berkshire Hathaway, Charlie Munger, 98 years old, still going strong, still trading, still rendering advice on national TV and national media, uh, giving uh, uh, speeches, still still doing uh, teaching, mentoring. Warren Buffett, the same age group, okay, doing the same types of things, still going. All right, so we have to shift our thinkings to match. Reality. Sometimes we get so bogged down in our own planning and our own thoughts about what we want to do, we end up projecting uh, concerns where they shouldn't be. So I bring up these points to say this: We, when you come in and develop, develop a plan, I've shown you now. Just this was a random selection of ways that we manage money and and help our clients. Okay, and that outshines those performance results. Just outshine. Anything that's out there, I could take. I could take any number of other brand name models that are available to you out there from from companies and show you the same type of thing. Point is this, okay? One, you need to be willing to let us help you. Two, when we plan and design, we provide a written risk reduction recipe. It's up to you to follow it, but we're going to tell you and advise you along the way. Year one, do this in this dollar amount, and, and, and this is why. Year two, do this and that. All you need us around for right now is the next couple of months to help you get the plan developed and implemented, okay? Then all you need us around for, in the best sense, ideally would be through the shifting period that, uh, that, that applies to your particular uh, uh, plan calculations and everything to get you to where the end result is that you want to be. And at that time, at the end of that period, you're set for the rest of your life. You may need some guidance along the way following that, 
but that 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 is more of a of a minimized uh, scenario than it is when it when it's right up front. We're putting this together, and we tell you what to do. That's why we give it to you in writing. Life is going to happen to somebody every single day. Just uh, last week, we were coming up 400 northbound and just getting on the uh, freeway, and there was a bad rollover. Okay, in an SUV. And that young man thought he had his whole life in front of him, okay? And so we, none of us know uh, where we're going to be at from moment to moment. That's why we write things down. That's why it's preserved. That's why you have this available to you because you know that way what the plan is. We have it preserved online in a vault, encrypted, secured for you. You can have it with your important papers. It's preserved in the cloud. You can go to it. So you have this security of knowing what the options are and what the plans are regardless of whom to whom life happens okay now that's also why we use large institutions okay generally because as faces come and go the institution will remain and that's why the bulk of our planning is around these foundational types of issues such that when you need the money, okay, the institution is going to be there. That's why we use save dependable institutions. They're going to be there that you can go to and, and, and have, uh, if there's a question to be answered at that point in time, it's more, it's, it's a smaller content and rather than substantively, okay, but we put it together so that your foundation of your life's planning and your life retirement is already set. All you have to decide is to when you're going to pull that trigger six, seven, ten years down in the future, turn on those income streams, make available those cash piles to you tax free for the rest of your life and all of the other money that's, that's in the market that we've grown for you. You make your decisions accordingly because it's icing on the cake, okay? You don't need us around. We don't need to be there. We want to be, we hope to be, but you don't have to have us there. We've done our job in the first two to three months that we've met you in that first year, okay? And after that, everything is submitted. You know what the plan is to go uh, down the road because everything for m nine out of ten middle class uh, Americans and, and our clientele is put it together and submitted into place at that time, okay? And then you're done. You're done. It's all set. You're going to have your subsistence for the rest of your life, tax optimized, and then all the other things uh, are something that are not a necessity for you to have. You can have them, they're extras, okay? It's icing on the cake. That's how we do our plans. That's why we provide a value add to you. All we ask of you is A, let us help you do it, and B, be, become so happy with the services and the results that we provide that you tell your fans, uh, uh, your fans, your friends, family, and co and colleagues, and, and preferably your fans online too. Yeah, if you got a lot of those. But that's that's the exchange. Okay, we we do that for let us help you. Be so happy with the results and the services that you tell your friends, family, and colleagues, and uh, and, and refer them to us. All right. That's where we want to be. We want to make you happy so then we get to stay happy. And until then, you stay happy. Until next week, I'll see you then.